Hi everybody, this is Peter from Netgear. In this video, I'm going to demonstrate how to configure your video recording schedule and settings when using the Milestone Arcus app on your ReadyNAS. First, let's log into our ReadyNAS and launch the Milestone Arcus app. Next, go to Settings, Cameras, select the camera you wish to configure and click configure go to recording so here's where you configure the re your recording schedule as well as some very important settings so by default the system already presents you with three different recording schedules you can continuously record 24 by 7 you can record on motion detect 24 by 7 or you can simply not record any video at all. Now if you want to create your own schedule you go to this section right here. Each of these represents an hour of the day of the week and to change what's here select one of the three different types of recording. As an example, what I want to do is to, for most of the week, record on motion detect, but on Monday I want to record the whole day continuously. So what I do is select record continuously and fill all the hours of Monday with this setting. I also want to configure it so that it does not record motion at all on weekends. So let's select the do not record setting and fill up all the hours of the weekend with do not record. And as you can see, everything else is record on motion detect. Now, once I'm done with this, be sure to save our schedule. I'm going to call this no weekend and click OK. Now we have a custom schedule that continuously records on Monday, records on motion detect from Tuesday to Friday and does not record at all Saturday and Sunday. If you want to toggle back to one of the presets simply select them from the drop down menu. And finally, you have some parameters here where you can tell the system to record a number of seconds uh, before motion was detected, how many seconds to record after the motion has ended, as well as how long you want to retain that video on your ReadyNAS and how much um, disk space you want it to use. And you can also toggle whether or not to record audio here. Hope this was helpful. Thanks for watching.